everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Gerard and today marks a very special day. No need for introductions what this video is going to be about. It's obviously about this brand new M3 Impact. I've got it in front of me to celebrate this awesome day with me. I've got my good friend Kevin de Toy, which is a Protea shooter for South Africa. He's a gold medalist and this guy knows his stuff when it comes down to bench shooting. So. I'm honored to have him on my channel today and he will be joining me for today's hunt. Let's get busy and I can't wait to tell you more about the new M3. It's a perfect day for a perfect gun. So I'm not going to waste any time, let's jump straight into it. Down she goes, 59 yards. Ouch. Oh, funny. Now the very first thing you will notice on the gun is the huge power plenum here in the back. And yes, it is bigger than the older one. This is a whopping 72 cc of air. Now the new power plenum pushes the power levels even more. Plus for the guys who's looking at the shot count, this gun will get you there with a lot of shots now and making it very air efficient. Ah, smoked him, 127 yards. Ouch, 75 yards. On a closer look at this gun, no longer is there only two air gauges, but three. The reason for this is, this gun has not one, but two regulators now in it. And the whole idea behind this is that regulator number one takes off the working pressure of regulator number two, which means the whole gun will work even better. Now looking even closer at these gauges, you will notice that it is brand new gauges from Wicker. Oof. Knocked him down, 99 yards. <laughs> 75 yards. <laughs> 43 yards, down like a brick. <laughs> Do you notice something different here in the front? Yes, the air cylinder is a 580cc and all the sniper additions on the M3 come standard now with a 580 air cylinder, which is awesome. Ooh, smoked him, 77 yards. <laughs> Knocked him solid. <laughs> 55 yards. Oh, <laughs> dead on the spot, 95 yards. Now looking at the front side that you're looking at, you will see that the cocking lever is sitting on your side. And if you notice something, the cocking lever is shorter and the grip handle is fatter and that gives you much better grip on the cocking and gives you a better stroke when you cock the gun now 
And another bonus, left hand shooters, you can now swap your cocking arm from the right hand side to the left hand side without any aftermarket parts. Smoked him, 75 yards. Ninety-four yards, smoked him. Down like a brick. Good news for everyone out there who wants to tinker with their guns. This new M3 has got a brand new system called the Quick Tune system from FX. Number one, the micro adjuster. The micro adjuster has got small little increments of 0.25 that you can adjust your power. The next thing is the macro adjuster. The macro adjuster has got a 16 step wheel which you can also clip up and which will increase your power also in different increments. With those two combining with each other and the valving and the regulators, it is endless the way you can tune this beautiful new M3. Oh. Very dead, 81 yards. In the box, dead. Ooh. Smoked him seventy two yards. Usually, when you want to shoot power you need to add a dual transfer port to your barrel. That is something of the past now. The new system has the dual transfer ports already incorporated in there. On the one side, you will see the dual port and you will see it's marked with the letter S, meaning slug shooting, or the guys who wants to really power up their gun can flip it to that side and insert it into the back of the valve block. And now you can shoot high power. If you want to go down with your power and you only want to shoot pellets, it is as easy as pulling the barrel a little bit out and turning it 180 degrees and inserting it back in again and now you can shoot low power which means pellets or anything smaller <laughs> smoked in 67 yards <laughs> oh smoked him 71 yards Dead. 128 yards, little house sparrow, down. Looking just above the new 580cc bottle, you will notice that the new valve adjuster knob looks much larger than the old one, and you will see it is got a brand new design to it. It's knurled for better grip. And for the guys with bigger hands like me, can now easily adjust the valve adjust in the front. Standard, you can still leave it at four lines, but for the guys who are shooting slugs or really want to push the power up, don't be afraid to go past that four line anymore. Out at 100 yards now, got a target down there. I'm going to do a five shot group for you quickly with a new M3. And I'm shooting 40 grain slugs out of this gun, 22 caliber. Let's see.
That's not bad at all. Let's have a look at that. Here's your group, five shots at 100 yards. The first four, you can see I can cover that with my thumbnail. That's about a half an inch. If I add the one that just went out of the group slightly, that's about an inch group at 100 yards. The last one that came out there could have been me or a little bit of wind, but that's pretty much what you're gonna get out of the new M3 with a 40 grain slug. Now with everything that I just showed you about the new M3, can there be anything more? The answer, yes. Thanks for watching and all hail the king.